Hey, good afternoon. I hope you're having a wonderful day. I am working on changing out my winter planner to a spring planner. And this is kind of a part two video. And so I was having a really hard time because everything is Easter when I start looking for spring stuff. And then everything is also this pink and blue that I found through here. Um, so I was having a hard time. But I want to jump on here real quick, too, because I realized that my friend Virginie has a really great product out right now. Let me bring that up for you. And it's got master resale rights, so you can do a ton of things with this. Um, redoing a winter planner is just one of those many things that you can do. And sorry, I'm bringing up her page right here for you guys. Okay. So she's got a few different um, master resale rights. Um, this one here is one that I was oozing all over. I don't have this one. But what I do have, and I realized when I was looking at it, this uh, peach and green is a, is a very good fit for my planner that I have already started. And I had already bought this the other day. And so I realized that most people are combining Easter and spring items together um, to sell digital papers and such forth with. They're not the same thing, y'all. So people that are looking for spring are not always looking for Easter and vice versa. So this part it is wonderful. Um, she does have, oh, she's got a lot of pictures down here that you can see all of her products. I love how she does it. She is having a wonderful sale. $37 would still be a great steal because they include master resale rights, which means that you can use it in your private label right items that you sell. And she is having a 50% off sale that I will include the link below. And this is one that I was using all over. Well, this is one that I have. And then this is the one that I'm going to get. Because look at this, y'all. So you got the six covers, six interiors. Um, I think that's like the interior dashboard for the planner. I don't do digital planners that much. I tried in the beginning and haven't really gotten back around to it. But this may inspire me to do so because it is really, really pretty. Um, so that's everything that you get in her MRR kit. And I will leave the link down below for you guys. And it is just $27. That's still a really good deal. But she has a 50% off sale. And so with this, it's going to make it really easy for me to go through here. I may take out that page because I don't know that the purple is really going to match. I'll pull it up um, and take a look. And this is a really great way that you can do that with. Yeah, that one's not going to flow. Not going to keep it jiggy. We'll take it out later. Got that saying from one of my friends. Y'all might be tired of hearing me say it, but we're from Georgia, y'all. And so, um, let's see how many people leave when I say y'all. So anyways, the one reason we love these cute little trucks, we'll make sure everything's still centered. I did that the other day. And then one really cool thing that I did do, these flowers used to be pink. Uh, but since I saw this digital paper in the background, what I did do is I clicked on edit the image. I clicked on filters and see all. And then I clicked on this pretty little guy there. And it changed it to that color for me. Isn't that really cool? Because then if you want it to be purple, it can be purple. So look, it can make that flower be, I won't say whatever color you want it to be. But um, there's a lot of opportunities to change the colors there. And then you've got these um, options as well. It can even be bright green. How about that? <laughs> I like that. Not really for this planner, but I do like that um, option that you have there. So then you can easily come through here and change out. We're going to go ahead and change out this blue. Yeah, I need to do some work on this. I may just redo the sheet there um, to get rid of those little dots. We'll come in with a screen. And so I'll put that there. That means we're going to have to redo that, which is fine. We can redo it with that green um, or even do it with an orange. 
not orange, peach. I don't know why I said orange. You can do that right there if you wanted to. Make that in the peach background. It's got so many pretty things here. You can make this. Oh, that is pretty. I like that. I like that a lot. Then you can come in here if you don't like it being that green color. I am on the wrong browser, y'all. Um, I've got a little browser picker installed on my other Canvas screen. Let's see if I can save it and pick it up real quick. Might be able to do that. Save. Yep, yeah, we've got that one going on over there. And what I'm doing is just bringing up my Canva account. See if I can show you what I meant really quick. We'll make that big so we can go ahead and scroll down here. And then if you want to change that um, out, let's see if it's going to be right for me. It should because I'm in Internet Explorer. that has got the color picker. So yay. You can come in here if you want to pick up, let's say, that color. That's too brown. You can make it peachy. And then if I want to grab that, what I could do. Do that color. And yes, I want to change all. Looky there. Yep, we're going to hide those. Well, I may leave those dots there now because I'm actually they match now. <laughs> now. You can come in here since it's not holiday time. You know, you can change that to whatever you want. You can change that to a cleaning spring to-do list, which is what I was doing on the next page. And so I'll come in here and change that paper out. You can change it to one of these light colors. Spring cleaning. And then if you wanted to add a, a flower. Hey, looky there. That matches. How pretty is that, y'all? I like that a whole lot better. Yay. Now it's keeping jiggy, y'all. All right, I was messing around with squares earlier, as you can see. I don't remember why I was having a such a hard time earlier. And fix your squares. I'll worry about lining everything up later. I just want to come through here and show you guys. You can change out everything real simple. Make that color better. So what I'm going to do is come in here. Okay, yeah, we'll go ahead and change out some. Not change them out, but line everything up. Okay, that still has a little circles back there. But then what you can do, though, is you can just say, no, I don't want to delete it. You can say duplicate. And then you can lock that sheet. Actually, what I want to do is delete that sheet. You'll see why. Go elements. I'm going to change it to white. Oh, yay. And then we're going to you want to come through here and just do new squares that's how it's all over messing up those squares you can do that and then you can just go draw a square here if you want a white and black square you can do that too just search and see all and then you can do the search for the free search that I can talk, talk at the minute at the moment. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me, sorry guys, my allergies are insane because this is insane weather. It's Georgia. All right, I'm gonna do something here real quick.
They were both centered and lined up because it grabbed them both. Grab them both either two ways, try to circle it, or you can um, come in there after you straighten up your square that moved on me. You can do, let's see, shift and shift, no, control. No, it's not doing it for me. But anyway. There is a way that you can grab both and copy. Sometimes you may have to grab both and hit group up there and then copy. By the time that you do all that, you can just have it done just like that. Now see, those little irritating dots are gone. If you want that peach, you can have keep it peach. Or if you want it to be black, I like the peach better. I don't like that font. This is I do like that one though, but we'll have to make it smaller. We can come through here and do it again one more time. I'll just say change all and then living room. I don't want to change everything to that color, but you can do. And that way I'm holding down the shift key to grab everything. Just do it like that. There we go. Then if you want to just get rid of that page all together, you can just duplicate that, duplicate that page. Change out the rooms. Um, you know, garage, laundry room. You won't have two kitchens unless you're super rich, probably. Let's see, we'll go kids room. No. Something like that. All right, and then you've got your monthly calendar and your checklist. We'll go ahead and change out that page there. I'll go ahead and grab one of these greens. May just go with a solid green though. There's some replace background blue. We'll change it to is that green? No. Maybe that green? No. Pretty damn green. <laughs> Sorry, didn't mean to say. <laughs> Oopsie. Alright, so that means I'll need to come in here and just change that background. Go with white. It's not bad. Not bad at all. And that way you don't have to clean out everything. Uh, go through there and change out everything else. Because that cleaned another brain. Change transparency on that. This page I really don't like at all. So we're just going to scrap that one. That one is peach anyway. Go through there. 
a really easy way to change everything out. Likewise, if you don't want that um, line there, it's there because it was imported from a PowerPoint that I made. Yep. You might be wondering, what is she doing? It's okay, a lot of people wonder that. I'm sure. See? Nope, oh, that didn't do it. Alright, let's go. Delete. Well, I don't want to do that. Alright, so once we, um, we actually went and started changing this out in PowerPoint, which I can show you all that in the next video. Um, duplicate the page. If you really want to hide it, what you can do. <laughs> Don't really recommend it because it's for the 12 um, pages there. We can actually do that and then copy the page 12 times. Right. Oh, that's going to be a very long, tedious process, though, to y'all. Probably not going to look good right there. <laughs> I had to only try to change the outline, which that did it. But anyway, it's not centered either, though. So um, if you want to center that, you can just go position, center. That didn't position it either. Um, but anyway, you can go through there and play with the months and everything, get that changed out the way that you like it, and just come through here and change out. I'll show you all an easier way to change out the month, the calendar pages. Christmas. Sorry, didn't even realize I was doing that. What's <laughs> hey. that one, dude? I'm going to find another foot part. If you like better, you could do that. I may wind up doing a download and upload again to get rid of those butt squares. Oh, I like that. That was cool. Looky there. They come in here. I don't know why I got my bay there. Likewise, this would be a good one that you can actually change out the life planner that I have, as well as many others for your spring stuff. So this is a very awesome way to use for Jenny's clip art. I uh, don't want to take up too much of your time today. There's a thousand other things that you can make with your clip art. You can do journals. I'll come out with another video for that. Um, possibly tomorrow. That's a bit busy. When you import from PowerPoint, sometimes you get all these little leftover things. 
that does that outline that I need to find a way to redo it or you can if you have another calendar that you want to bring in you can do that too let me take a look and see if I have another one I want to use real quick because I did recently make another calendar let's see here just looking for a minute guys Give me just a moment here I hope you're having a wonderful day You know what? I've got a really good one here that I can combine with. Yeah. Let's do it this way. I'm going to take that off completely. I'm going to come in here and take that away. And you'll see why. Alright, work with me here. I need my white sheet back. Or white square, should I say. Come through here. You might be thinking that's really hard while looking at the moment. And you would be correct in saying that. We're going to go ahead and center it. We're going to come in here and change it to white. Send backwards. Send backwards. backwards no yep. I don't know why that didn't copy over any better all right so let's go like that what I'm trying to do is bring over okay hold on a second I think I know why You know what? It'd be a really good time to show y'all too. It is not wanting to play nice in the neighborhood. Let me try one more thing. Alright, so you can come in here. We can start with a white square. That's what we can do. We'll start with a white square. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five. Five. All right, wait so what I am counting. Let's see here. And you know what? There's an even easier way to. You can search for a free calendar. I was going to say that one's super cute. That one's not bad. You don't need food on the top of it. I do have another one that I made. And then that's free. Because what we want to do is grab just some of it if we can. And that's a really cute one too if y'all want to put, um, sure we'll do it that way. If you want to put anything at the top of that, like even a, um, if you want to use one of my mandalas, you can do that too. Hold on. Did it wipe it all out? Yeah, I did. All right, so we're going to go reverse, reverse. Okay, we'll come back to that. And then, well, you can just duplicate this puppy, too, because it does say monthly. 
So if you wanted to say, you know, call it January, you can do that. And then just copy this one 12 times. So do that real quick. I think we have it on here for a hot minute. After I show you that, then I'm going to go ahead and end it. Video. Well, you know, you should just go to um, and come through and change everything. I think. And then you can delete out the pages that you didn't need. You can go through and change it. I'm going to go ahead and stop sharing that in a moment. Have a great day. Bye.